This is the partner count, female promiscuity over time. Uh, partner count, in, and this is for females, okay? So if it's that bright green that you see on the end here, that's uh, that's the lowest end, and then uh, the red is the highest end here. So uh, the, the bright green is virgin at marriage. If you can see that, I don't think you can. Um, one premarital partner, two premarital partners, three premarital partners, four to nine is the sort of like hot pink one, and then the red one right next to it is 10 premarital, 10 plus premarital partners. Okay, so the 1970s, if we look at the majority here between, say, like 21 and 43% there, they are either virgin at marriage or they have one premarital partner all the way up. So you're looking at about 64% of women in the 70s didn't have more than one premarital partner. 16% had two premarital partners. 8% had three and 10% had only four to nine there. You don't even get to the hot red one right there until really the 2000s. Now, if you look at 80s, you can see the distribution is different there. So again, it's going really from uh, from left, or excuse me, from right to left. So you look at the 17% there in the 80s, 36, and you can look at the distribution right there, okay? So why does this matter? I've, I've We've talked about this a lot. I, I have some new resources here, and that's why I wanted to throw this one up here, is marital stability, happiness, and STDs. So if you look at marital stability and you look at the red lines here the, at the bottom there, that corresponds with the 10 plus premarital partners and the percent of women in long lasting marriages, percent of women reporting themselves as happy in their marriages and a uh, percentage of women infected with STDs, as you can see. So when, when, when people say, well, it shouldn't matter what my partner count is. Okay, I've, I've done full shows on that, by the way. It does matter. It matters, ladies, because, well, because of the stats, first of all. Second of all, it matters because men see you as a bad reproductive choice. And it's not because of society. It's not because of social constructionism. It's because on a fundamental evolutionary innate level, men are repelled the revulsion response are repelled by women who seem to be in some way kind of easy or they already have kids. It's already confirmed. She's already had children. So therefore, if I get involved with her, she is a bad bet for my reproductive future because now I've got to take care of some other schmuck's kid that she decided to breed with, plus hopefully my own, assuming she wants to have kids with me now and not just be invested in that one guy. I did a show, um, I wasn't a show, it was a, a part of a segment of a show where I talked about how women um, would name, I mean, you guys probably heard this before, women would uh, name their children after their alpha fucks boyfriend. The guy that, the hot guy that they had sex with, or the guy that they, maybe they could, maybe the child isn't actually his, it might be her husband's, but she names him Chad. Because the guy that she met when she was so crazy in her college years, who really, you know, rocked her boat, the alpha widow, that you know, the, the guy that made her an alpha widow, he was so significant in his impact with her that she says, "You know what, honey? I think we're going to name the boy Chad because it's my uh, my uncle's uh, name, or my 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 great great grandfather was called Chad." <laughs> That's how you get stuff like it because it's it, it's that. That instinct, right? It's that want for optimization, whether they have it or they don't. In some small way, they want that reminder of what they could have had or what they're supposed to have had, right? The soulmate, the one that got away. Again, it, we're looking at social conventions that in some way promote either one sexual strategy, a male sexual strategy or a female sexual strategy. In a gynocentric social order, it will always be a female sex, uh, strategy that is prioritized anyways.